Perth's new billion-dollar children's hospital has run into more trouble. The opening delayed for at least another month. The health minister is blaming last month's asbestos scandal. But Rebecca Johns, he can't tell us when the hospital will open. Emmy, builder John Holland was supposed to hand over the keys to the site tomorrow, but that's no longer going to happen until the building has been given the all clear. The $1.2 billion Perth Children's Hospital was already well behind schedule. We were told it would finally be fully up and running by November. Those plans are now in disarray. The Health Minister isn't putting a timeline on the opening, only saying he's hopeful it will be operating by the end of the year. John Day says he's disappointed by the delay. As the government, we are the client here on behalf of West Australian taxpayers and we are in the hands of John Holland and it's their responsibility to hand over the hospital uh, in a manner that is safe. The reality is that we want them to get it right so that that hospital is perfectly safe, ready to go on the day it finally does open. The doctors' union says while the delay is frustrating, patient safety is the number one priority. In the meantime, WA's sick children will continue to be treated at Princess Margaret Hospital.